Hey guys, this is Kapal69 from YouTube, I guess. And today I will show you how to use, uh, no, not how to use, how to control your computer using nothing but your iPod Touch. Now this is really simple, okay? So me, I'm using a 2G iPod Touch. See the 2G right here? See that? See that right there? It's really visible with the uh, buttons right there. Anyways. Yeah, it's 2G iPod. You can do it even with a 1G. It's jailbroken, but you don't need to jailbreak it because uh, all you need is the App Store and a computer that works pretty fine. So that's it. You unlock your iPod and you go to the App Store. Open up the App Store. Right over here. <clears throat> all right. Now, once on the App Store, I want you to go to the search bar. Wait just a sec. I want you to go to search and type in PNC alright now once you type in PNC hit search and the one on the top it should be called Mocha VNC Lite it should be free see right there you can't see it because my camera is a little blurry so hit that one and it should be Mocha VNC Lite I repeat Mocha VNC Lite so you hit free and install and it should install mine is already installed so I can't do that so then you go back home and you open VNC. You can't look at it. You can't. It doesn't look very nice. It's a little white square with a computer screen and, and it's green and it says VNC. Anyways, so you open that up and it should look like this. It should guaranteed look like this. Anyways, now lock it. Go to your computer screen. So you're gonna have to download a uh, tight VNC server. Uh, unluckily. Unluckily, I do not have the download link because I lost it. But uh, anyways, try to find it from someone else on YouTube. Probably gonna do that. It's gonna take five minutes. Anyways, this it should look like this. Yeah, with uh, this in the corner. So yeah, once you've downloaded that, all you gotta do is set a password over here. Easy password, you know, with six characters at least or something like that, and hit OK. Now you should have that little thing in the corner, and once you put your arrow on it, there should be win VNC and some codes. Now, what I want you to do, I want you to go back to your iPod here, and you're gonna see this, right? So you're gonna go menu, in the top left corner. You can see this the top one. It says edit connections. Hit that. You're gonna have all kinds of connections. Hit the first one, of course. It'll be logical. And it says on the top it says VNC server IP address. So you hit there. And now on your computer, see so remember over here when you put your arrow on uh, the VNC, it says codes. Well, it says win VNC and it says uh, numbers. Those numbers you have to put them over here. It's probably going to start by 192.168 and the rest is to your computer. It should be different for everyone. Anyways. Now once you put in those codes, you should go a little down and it says VNC password. The password that you've set on your computer, like I told you before, write it over here. Mine's already set. When you're done, do two things, simple, hit connect, top right corner. Now like that, and it should look like your computer screen. You can even put it sideways, and you have your computer screen. Now. You can even zoom in, so like that, and you can use your mouse over here. Now, once you zoom in, you can move around. See, look, I'm gonna minimize my page, okay? Now look over here I have minimized my page now say I want to open this folder look at my arrow see look at my arrow on the computer say I want to open just a second I'm having a little trouble here that folder I'm gonna open it I don't even touch a mouse now I want to open that folder. It's going to open. And say I want to open this one. It's going to open. 
Hey, it's pretty awesome, right? Hit the little X button right there. Just like I'm having a little trouble. Hit that little X button. Right, so now I close it. Now, even from my computer, as you see, you can even look through my computer what I'm doing right now. now I'm going to open back to YouTube for the rest of the video. And it's pretty simple. It's not so complicated. It's easy to use. And say someone's on your computer. Of course, you have to uh, be on your computer first to put on uh, type VNC. The server, you have to put it on. And then you have to go to your iPod, you have to click connect, and you say, let's say you have your brother, you say, hey, uh, go to the computer, I mean, I'm going to go to my room, I don't know, I'll play with my iPod or something, go whack off or something, you use the computer. So uh, while he's using the computer, you could go over here and fuck around. So with that, he says, hey, what the fuck's happened with the computer? You know, he, so he would go crazy. So it's a pretty awesome app, really easy to use, easy to, to set, it's not so hard. So, uh, yeah, that's it. Capella69 from YouTube. And guys, I tell you, thanks for watching. Try it out. It really works. Pretty awesome. Thanks for watching again.